Oh no. Hello. And so I'm Cage Green and this is this week's vlog. It's very early. So the plan for today is between now and about 4 p.m. Well, now and half three because I need to go and get ready. I'm gonna make some huge big colour thing and then at four o'clock my babe in arms and fellow golf detective uh, Magenta Lust, who I will link all of her things down below, um, is gonna come pick me up. We are gonna drive to Aberdeen, we're gonna swing past somewhere to get coffee, then drive to Aberdeen near Aberdeen to go and meet a photographer called Jeff Lee who I've met a couple of times, absolutely lovely um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go and try and make a collar don't know why I decided to make a collar we had all this planned and then last night I was like yeah, you know what, collar, that's what I'm gonna do To the day! Right, so I've decided what I definitely need is some kind of uh, structure to support the weight of various fabrics and stuff. So at the moment I'm totally missing that one. I completely forgot to do it. Got some uh, white leather and um, two layers, and I'm just sewing up the beer channels to put this stuff through which is 10 millimeter metal case boning. Um, have a walking fit on my machine um, because otherwise it would just not handle this stuff at all. Um, especially as there's two layers of it, it makes it really really thick. Um, and I've not actually even bothered to measure out my channels. Uh, I'm just kind of guesstimating a little bit with the width of the fit and stuff. Um. <sighs> so, the little snippy snippy pliers that I used to use to cut this boning, which, I mean, fair enough, it's tough and it's sore on the hands and stuff like that, but it cut through it. Is now just not cutting it. So I'm gonna make this work. What I'm gonna do is sew an extra strip of stitches in the middle where I'd marked them out originally anyway and I'm gonna uh, do the animators trick of twisting together two strands of wire uh, with a drill so that it's really strong and really sturdy and I'm gonna put two channels of that up in it instead and I was also thinking that probably the best way to stop it flopping about so much is to do a channel at the top and a channel at the bottom. So I'm going to do that, but I'm going to do it with the bias binding when I close the edge anyway. And then I'll slip a little bit of wire through so that it's a little bit stiffer and less floppy in between the channels, if that makes sense. <sighs> Okay, so I figure seeing as I'm putting this into the vlog I should probably put a little bit of a safety announcement thing along with it. So um, what this is is twisting the wire together with a drill. So you get a really long strand of wire, it goes from one side all the way around something sturdy and strong and back in to the drill so that this side is twisted and held tight and it's not going to flop around when you do the drill and this side goes into the drill and then to start off you just do a couple of small I'm just going to secure that properly before I show you <laughs> so you pull it as taut as you can because as, uh, as you put the drill um, if there's any lack, slack to this it's going to start spinning around 
um, and that could be really dangerous if it whacks you in the face or anything like that. So you then start with just a couple of very gentle small twists. So before I finish this up, it's got all its wire pretty much in it, apart from this one last one to go here. Um, so what I've been doing is uh, laying the wire on, cutting it to size, making sure that I've got enough extra fabric at either side to still stitch with. Uh, and then I'm taking a tiny little bit of white electrical tape just to blend it in. So I've uh, checked a little bit of bias binding on and another line of this all the way around and it's sitting much further back which is good because that gives us this place here to play with this decorative whatever but time is starting to run a little bit short so better be some quick decorative stuff. <laughs> it's half past four and I have done what I can. It is not what I planned, but I did what I sorry, do you need to see past my arm and I'm like no, no, it's fine. locking you in. <laughs> fine. It's a quiet road. If it was busy you might have a problem. It's okay. We won't die here today. Um drove you across Germany? <laughs> like think I can handle Scotland. Oh yeah. <laughs> Good times. Right. Yay! Good job. So it's um, 20 to 2 in the morning and uh, we're just back in Dundee. <laughs> I'll blur it out, but it'll be fine. Nobody will know what the red thing was. <laughs> um, yeah, that was a really, really good shoot. It was great fun meeting Jeff and it was great fun having a little shoot with him. And now it's really, really dark because we're leaving the petrol station. <laughs> Should I not? Yeah! <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. There you go. There's some light. I don't think we're allowed to drive. No, light on. we're not really allowed to drive with the light. Okay, on, we're I'll go. Quick, anyway, quick, 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 quick. love you all. Bye. Bye.